Natasha. I'm from P2I and we're here today showing off our nano coating technology. Now I've got two tissues, one's treated with our technology and the other one isn't. Our coating is a thousand times thinner than a human hair so you can't see a difference and you can't feel a difference but I'm going to pop these into the water and you'll be able to notice something very special. So if I put both of these into the water you begin to see that one has got very, very wet while the other one has stayed nice and dry. And in fact, if I put more water on there, it will simply beat up and roll off. Now the reason it does this is because our hydrophobic layer that we've applied to the surface has neutralized that tissue. So water molecules are more attracted to themselves than they are to the tissue. Now if we do this on electronic devices, if I take a normal circuit board and I put water onto there, we see that it spreads out on the surface. Now this means that you're likely to get a lot of corrosion building up on there. However, if I do that with one which has our splash proof nano coating on, you can see that the droplets form beads instead. And in fact, if I give it a little twist, they'll simply roll off. So for device manufacturers like Motorola and TCL, what they find is on their products, instead of a buildup of corrosion developing because the water is sitting on the surface of the device, the water rolls away and their product remains corrosion free. And this is really for protection from everyday splashes and spills. However, at Mobile World Congress, we're very, very excited to be launching our dunkable technology. Now, dunkable is a hydrophobic barrier as opposed to a hydrophobic layer. Now this means it's slightly thicker and that way the water is not interacting with the electronics at all. So we've had that phone there under the water for an hour and 34 minutes so far and it's doing absolutely fine.